Construction to build a multi-million dollar water treatment facility in Eau Claire began today and when completed is expected to remove PFAS from our water supply. PFAS have been a concern in Eau Claire for several years and over half of our wells have been shut down since 2021. Now a new PFAS removal facility has broken ground with a price tag of $20 million. However, the city hopes most of that cost will be covered by a recent settlement with the company 3M and federal funding secured by the offices of Tammy Baldwin and Derek Van Orden. To get to this point, a lot of work behind the scenes. Um, we've remained committed to it. We work on this constantly. We've been working with our um, engineers at Gannett Fleming that we've hired, and we have a really good plan now. All indications are this will remove 100% of the PFAS from the water, and uh, I, I couldn't be more excited. This is a big day for the community. The two-story structure will be built next to the current water treatment facility. It will take roughly 18 months to complete. Special guests at Thursday's ceremony included Representative Derek Van Orden, State Senator Jeff Smith, and several city council members.